Chairperson, Bishop Dr. Sambeli TV. I thank you once again for coming on the platform. This is a pl platform that I try to educate the individual on the spiritual rudiment, if possible, the physical also. There are a lot that are lost this time around. So I've taken upon myself that the little one God gave me, I wouldn't hide it, but I will expose it for the world to see so that nobody deceives, deceives you. So if you are here this afternoon, this afternoon, count yourself blessed because I have a friend of mine uh, here. He has a very good product that he will be showcasing soon. So keep on listening. Remember, today's program is Revenge. Revenge. Or tit for tat. Or if you like, punishment. Or better still, pay him back. How you, however you take it. But the point is, there are some who have done something wrong to you. And you say, oh, and yes, you no, even God Himself doesn't forgive easily like that. Or Kadem or C, Mesma a for. Even God has a messenger that is only approaching to the dead. So if you commit any sin and He need to kill you, He will send an angel responsible for killing to come and kill you. So I am not teaching this for you to just do it for to anybody no. If you go to register a gun, they have to interview you, examine you, scrutinize you, if you can really handle the gun. If not, you just be shooting anybody. So they, they will have to scrutinize you carefully. So my brothers and my sisters, the lovers of Sam David TV, if you join us, kindly share this for us quickly so that people will come. I have an onion here, the yellow one, and then the red one. I'm going to display something sharp sharp. So please, I don't want you somebody to be late. So join me quickly and we, we go. Join me quickly. Join me quickly and let us see. Share, share. If you come online, share. Revenge. Pay me back. Mr. Fred, you're welcome. Thank you, sir. Do you think we, we have to have something, some direction that a revenge with a Christian to pay people back? Well, in this cosmos earth, we live in. Mm. Talk, talk. In this cosmos earth we live in, we live with human beings, even though they are spirit, but they live in the body. Now, the Bible even says that the heart of man is desperately wicked. And if the heart of man is desperately wicked, it means that the heart always seeks to do evil. And if the heart is always seeking to do evil, a path of their own evil path, and the gallows they dug for others, they must fall into it. If one digs a gallow, then you should fall into it. And by the grace of God, you don't fall into it. They must fall into their own path. So a revenge is where one has equally plan to destroy you mm. and you have just turned it back to him to taste of what he thought of mm. so revenge is not a strange word <laughs> okay. but we live with it because even the bible says that the heart of man is desperately wicked wow I mean the heart and the spirit of man seeks always to do evil so if one wants to do evil mm and digs a hole for you to come and fall into mm -hmm. it and by the grace you don't fall into it mm -hmm. you must fall into it only. 
So, if a Christian, a true believer, revenge, somebody has offended you, or has taken you to church, or has made you paralyzed, mm. you have not cried to God. God, deal with the person for me. Mm. And you have gone to extra my doing the direction I'm showing mm. to punish the person, to also get uh, crippled. Is he good as a Christian, Mr. Fred? Well, I will say yes and no. Okay. The yes is the intention behind your action. Okay. If the intention is to destroy me, mm -hmm. I will turn back the intention back to you and taste it if it is good. <laughs> oh, <then we> <laughs> Okay. No, in the sense that the word of God says that vengeance is the Lord. Mm. He says vengeance is the Lord. Vengeance is the Lord. Mm. Yes, you leave it into God and trust God he does it. Okay. But if that is when you know very well that that which you are going through, you have the faith in God mm. that you come out of it. Wow. Wow. Fantastic. Listen, I have seen a man with the experience, a man who carried a philosophical mind, who speaks and then you see wisdom flowing from the speech. He is an engineer, a pastor, whatever. All right. Mr. Flair, can we know some... Okay, before then... Revenge. Once he say revenge is good, you need red onion, the red one. You need the yellow one, onion, the yellow one. You need pepper. Not this one. This is powdered one. But there is a pepper that is uh, the normal pepper. Okay. But it is broken into pieces. Oh, okay. Yes, that one. one. The dry one. The dry one. Okay. Good one. Then you need pin or needle. Pin or needle. This one. These are the items. You need about 7, 14, 21 in that order. Okay. You need black pen. You need a knife. So this is a knife. No necessary mine, but any knife at all. But don't use kitchen knife that they use to slide things. You need manches. You need um, a bowl or a plate. Then you need black. Black candle. Black candle. You need one. You need three or seven. But I am going to use seven right now. If you use one, perfect. If you use three, perfect. If you use seven, perfect. It depends. Okay. So procedure. Let me check some message. Nathaniel Addison said, God is good. Thank you. Nathaniel, can you share it with at least 10 people on your contact? Ajua Osuman was here. Good day, Sam. God bless you. Thank you. Ajua, can you send it to 10 people on your contact? Uh, Amponsa Abe was Good teacher. Thank you. I salute you. Can you share it to at least 10 people on your contact? Happy, let them come and sit here. Okay. And God will bless you because today is going to be. I will. I will. Thank you. All right, viewers, I thank you for listening to the show. I would urge every Tom and Harry to contact the number that Mr. Fred put up. He's a trusted person, he's my man, body, body, who comes to me on wish. And then he has fixed some in my car. As for that one, he said, I've donated it to a thousand to just take it at a seat. I said, Wow, just like that? that? That is it. So, I've tried to contact him. I assure you, he's going to provide you a very good service. Let me wrap up quickly with this thing and then we go. I said, Today is revenge. Revenge. Or pay him back. Pay him back. These are the items that you need. Red onion. You know, I talked about onion before, what onion can do. Then you have yellow onion. 
Then your knife, your knife, your manchish, your pepper, the, the red one, the ashishipa, and then the black pen. Then you have black candle. Then uh, you have uh, that of uh, needles. Needles. The needle should be either one, three, seven, fourteen, twenty-one in that order. So anyone that pleases your heart, you do it like that. You need a bowl or a plate so that you can perform the rituals or whatever inside. So I place my bowl down here like this. Follow the instruction so that you don't go wrong, don't do the thing wrongly. I place everything like this. Get a brown paper, another this Get a brown paper. So I brought brown envelope. I'm going to destroy this one. I'm sure you are watching me. You send your comment. If uh, you don't get something, you send your comment quickly. And let me answer for you. Uh, somebody say it doesn't. You say you don't toilet well, or you are toileting plenty. I want to be sure of that, and I'll answer you. So I have something like this. So I want to just take off the middle part. So let me tear the four corners of the paper. One side, two side, three side, the fourth side. One thing I want you to understand is don't use scissors, blade or anything. Use your free hand to tear the four corners. See something, I tear the four corners. But I realize that this place is not straight. So somebody will do like this. And stop. No, once you tear this one, go around again. Four. So once I straighten that place, this is my second one, my third one, my fourth one. So I have a piece of paper in my hand. Okay. So this is my black pen. So the person who is dealing with me is called uh, Kojo Samson. Okay. So I'm writing his name here with black pen. Kojo Samson. Okay. Nice. Kojo Samson. I will find out the birth of Nana Usu to foresee. Oh, I am late, Usu. I don't know what's going on. No problem. Just watch this till the end. Then you go back and pick it from there. Okay. So I will try and find the birthday. The date, the birth date of Kojo Samson. So let's say Kojo Samson is born uh, 5th, 10, 1950. So I will write Kojo Samson, date of birth, 5th, 10 will be October 1950. I have it. I will repeat this again. This is one Kojo Samson date of birth. I will do another Kojo Samson date of birth. Another could you something date of birth three times on this paper. So let's go. Could you Samson 5 10 1950. Another could you Samson 5 10 1950. So I have could you Samson 5 10 1950. Could you Samson? 5, 10, 1950. Kojo Samson. 5, 10, 1950. 3. So let me put this paper down. Then I will take the yellow uh, onion. If you take red, it will not work. I mean what? Yellow. I will tell you the uses of the red too. Yellow. So I'm cutting it not this way, but this way. Like tie. You put it like a car tie. You cut it like this. You have to make sure that it doesn't. You have to make sure you don't cut it completely. You cut it half way. Okay, I think that's it. So you have a space E. You don't finish all. You don't cut all complete. You see, 
to cut it halfway. Uh -huh. Then I have Kojo Samson name and date of birth here. Somebody may ask if I don't have date of birth. If you don't have date of birth, then don't use paper. You need his picture and the name. You need his picture and the name. Don't tell me how you're going to get his picture. Social media, you, uh, uh, WhatsApp, you can monitor and get his picture, screenshots and all that. You fold it here. Bang, bang. Just make sure you put it in. My paper is too longer than the, the uh, onion. So you make sure you cut it well. You put it inside. Then, this one, you cut small parts. You just need small one. So don't be don't buy it to be big as my own. If I want it to show in the camera, that's why I bought big one. You cut small one like this. You slice it. There is a force that goes on when the red and then the yellow meet. So you, you slice small, small, like this. This is too big. You just slide it, manage it, slide it. Abu Bakar is in the mid. Abu Bakar, Mira, you welcome. You are late. Okay? You add it to the paper inside. The red one, you add it to the paper inside. Then you bring your pepper. I told you not this pepper. This is a powdered one. The red pepper. Uh, I apply hair, red one. That one. You pour your pepper. In just make sure it's in the bowl. You pour, you pour it in the bowl. You should pour it all over the this in don't mind. Make sure everything goes inside. Either the picture with the name or a brown paper with the name and date of birth. One of them. You are set with this one. Black candle. You are now to use the black handle. So, black handle will be here. You light your black candle. Like that. You can use one, it's okay. The three. You can use one, it's okay. But preferably use seven. Use seven. One will work, but use seven. Yeah, you put it here. So I'm using seven for you to see. You put it here. That's three. Uh, Four. I think one can be here. Five. Six. Good one. Okay. Seven. Okay. The reason why I made it stand, I can light it in my hand, do it like the first one, but that is not ideal. It is not uh, spiritually good. So you make it stand, then you light your candle. And remember, you don't light from right to the left. You, you light... Uh, Please, I, I'm doing a program. I'm, I'm, I'm doing a program. So call me later. Yeah, this is clockwise. So, okay, this uh, you light like this. Anti-clockwise. I think I'm doing the right thing. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Yeah, me a program. Why? You can frame me one hour later. Yeah. Yes. So I have my seven candles. You can use one. 
you can use three, you can use seven. But the seven is more perfect. If you have money, get 21 around. Perfect. Okay, now you have finished. So these are my pins. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Good. I have more here, but I have seven. You see black candle seven. Once I light the seven, I start feeling the heat here. Because it's black. Even signs, if you wear black, it absorbs heat. You feel the system. Okay. These are my pins. Kojo Samson. When you eat, you feel pain. You use the pin, you pierce inside. All should not get lost. Kojo Samson, you regret ever doing this thing to me. We are doing seven wish. Kojo Samson, you will come back apologizing to whatever you have done. Now, the yellow is representing Kojo Samson. So once you add these items, the spirit of him is connecting. Kojo Samson, you will paralyze in your room. Those are my words, so you can choose your own words if you, if you can. So you do your wish, you say your wish, you say your wish, then you finish all the seven. After you finish, you continue to, to revoke the seven wish repeatedly. So not to make a mistake, you write every wish down on the paper before you start. So you put it aside and you'll be watching. The same wish you will say, then you wait till the candle gets burnt. You can choose to stand up and do your own activity and let the candle go down completely before. I don't do it on the plastic table or something like that. Do it where then when the kernel got burned down, it will not you know, destroy anything. Now, after the candle, but if you can stay, you can stay awake. After the kernel got burned, take this and the bowl. Get any place, not in your area. Listen, not in your area. Because any consequences that might come to call you Samson. You will take some. That's why I say not in your area. The area which is not around your vicinity. Go there, somebody farm anywhere, dig the hole, bury this inside, close it, come in. You are done. Now, this take full cycle of the moon to manifest. It means 29 days or 30 days. Then you he start to feel the result. 29 days or 30 days start counting it by then all the things you wish the person start getting the result if you have any question quickly you can answer and listen i will off the candle right now yeah 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 in a spiritual i always say we don't blow the candle like that or we don't blow it like that because this is not anything you quench it by your hand. Take note of that. Anybody that have any question, you bring it online. When you come, just share it to as many as you can. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, Sam David TV. Sam David TV. The Sam is spelled S A A M. David TV. Sam is spelled. S double A M. David is spelled D A V I D. Then add the TV on YouTube. When you do S A M, Sam, you will not get me. So Sam David TV on YouTube. Quickly, and then you be you subscribe, you like the notification button. Any information that will be linked up, you will be able to get it right. Don't forget, uh, Mr. Fred, uh, technological building things that he has done. It is very good. I tested it. Call him. Let him do something here for you at home. You'll be blessed. Um, Nana, to force you. Okay, Bishop. 
if that person apologizes and you want it to 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 stop working on the person, what will you do? He has some clacking and in the But let me tell you something. In a spiritual way, anybody you want to deal with, you have to give the person the benefit of the doubt. When you get to a stand, you don't. This person has no regret at all before you deal with the person. Because reversing it may is 50-50. Anything reversing it is 50-50. It may come in or it may not. But I think next time I will teach that one too. But reversing it huh, is, is, is in two ways. So before you deal with you have to think. There are a lot of people who have done, who have done something to me, have not yet done because Jayo, Jayo, when it gets to some place and I do it, no amount of apology will come to my way and I'll accept it. That is why if a friend is working beside me, I give him the benefit of the opportunity. To a stand and I will tell you you are not my friend, it means there is no amount of uh, apology that I will take. So be mindful of that. Okay. I think that is all. Don't forget our prayer line. That comes on Sunday, Wednesday, Friday. We have taken it up ourselves that we will pray for you whilst you are asleep. There are a lot of people that are cursing you. It's not going to be well with you. It's not you will suffer and all. We will also say it's going to be well with you. At the end of the day, uh, the blessing will be more than the cursing. You get it. So please and please. I choose that now. See, please, can you do it to someone who has taken your wife? Ah! But if it is from your wife, you don't need to do anything. You have to investigate. But that wife too will your wife back out. And the Yama woman no rather. Yama woman no rather. Why should you do it to the man? The woman should know she's married. The woman should know she's married. Okay. So keep your question coming. I think there are some questions coming, but it's not coming. Maybe network issue, I will go before you start to come. This video, I want you to share this video as many as you can. As many as you can. I know you love me. You obey my instruction. Share it. This is Facebook. Share it. Go to YouTube. Share it as well. At least 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. God will bless you. Okay, God will bless you. Ah. Mpacho, me here program one.